happening right now. School bus safety week and changes could be coming to our area. That's right. A community group wants traffic to stop when a school bus is letting kids on and off the bus. But critics say they're safer with the law like it is right now. The only thing that stopped common ground from getting their message out this morning was a school bus. Have a good day. See you later. Love you, buddy. Pastor Kevin put his thoughts on hold so he could get his kids safely off to school. It's the first year his kids are even taking the bus. He wanted to wait until they were older. My wife is a teacher in Milwaukee, and in her 10 years, she's experienced three students at her school get hit by traffic. Last year was a five-year-old. Pastor Kevin and Common Ground want a new ordinance passed that would require traffic to stop when school buses are letting children on and off the bus. I believe it will endanger children's lives, and I certainly oppose it. That's because under current Milwaukee law, buses use yellow lights, which means drivers can go around as long as they use caution. Kids, some of them as young as three years old, are supposed to wait until the bus leaves and then make sure it's safe to cross. Alderman Terry Witkowski worries stop arms would mean those kids will quit watching for traffic. And if they're told to cross that it's safe, uh, they will cross. Uh, they depend on the adults to look after them. So I'm especially concerned about little children with this proposal. In other areas of the state, cars are supposed to stop for buses by law. We went on a ride along in Racine and found people doing exactly what Alderman Witkowski is worried about. Last year alone, police issued 800 violations. The argument that we would somehow make our children less safe by following the same rules as other towns and cities across the nation is absurd. The Public Safety Committee does not have the bus ordinance on its agenda for its upcoming meeting on Thursday, but Alderman Witkowski said it could be on the agenda for their next meeting, which is in mid-November. 